I'm Lisa Adams. I'm the Associate Dean for Global Health at the Geisel School of Medicine at Dartmouth. The, the purpose of the um, Rwanda Human Resources for Health program is, in short, in essence, to build a sustainable and high quality health care system and medical education system for Rwanda. It's a seven year program, so it's a serious and significant commitment to um, rebuild the system by engaging U.S. faculty members in medicine, nursing, oral health, health management, um, really all the, the uh, some of the critical sectors in, in um, healthcare delivery and healthcare education. And by bringing all these uh, partners together to participate in rebuilding and strengthening the Rwandan medical education system so that they can have a self-sustaining and high quality healthcare system. Geisel was one of eight U.S. medical schools that was invited to participate in this program to be part of a consortium of medical schools, nursing schools, dental schools, and, and health management schools to participate in this program in a, in a very significant um, and meaningful way. We were very honored by the invitation. We felt like it um, was a nice reflection of the commitment to global health and um, health equity that Geisel has made. Um, and we're among some very esteemed and distinguished um, partner schools um, in this consortium. I think, uh, as evidenced by the role of the Clinton Health Access Initiative, um, or CHI, in this work, it's, it's really a testimony of President Clinton's commitment to this work and to this program. Having someone of President Clinton's stature um, stand behind this program, support this program, make now his second trip to Rwanda at the start of the second year of this program um, is very exciting and certainly is going to go a long way towards revitalizing and sort of recharging everyone um, around uh, this, this, pro this program and around the goals of this program. Um, I know that President Clinton has been quoted as saying that he, he feels great regret over what he considers a personal fa failure that the U.S. did not respond um, to the Rwanda genocide and crisis in a timely manner. Um, and this is really an opportunity to turn something uh, good out, have something good come out of something that was very tragic and, and painful um, on many levels. But I think his, his commitment is, is very evident to this program and I think that that means a lot to the, um, all the U.S. faculty involved in the program. I think it means a lot to the Rwandan people, to the Rwandan leadership. Um, it's just been a really fantastic partnership between um, the U.S. and, and Rwanda.